Hey, what's up YouTube? I hope everybody's having a great day. In today's video, I wanted to make a quick one about how you can share paid Android apps with your family members. That's right, there's no reason to repurchase the same paid apps, for example, like Minecraft, for each one of your children. You can actually share a paid app. So let's jump right into it and I'll tell you how it's done. Okay, so to get started, what you wanna do is you wanna open up your Play Store. Once you get into your Play Store, you wanna click on the user icon and you wanna scroll down all the way down to where it says settings. Under settings, you're gonna go into family and then here you're gonna click enable family. So once you do that, then you can go into family library settings. You can go into apps and games. And here you can select to automatically allow to share your apps when you're downloading them. So then when you go back, click on your username again and hit library. And you'll now see this icon that says family library. And you will see the apps that you've purchased in the past that you will have ability to share. And once you do that, then you can add family members to your family and you can invite up to five people. So then on your, for example, kids devices, you just search for the game that you want that you have shared. For example, let's say it's Minecraft and then they will have the option to download it without paying for it. Yeah, so I thought this was uh, a very neat feature because obviously you're saving money not having to repurchase the same apps for your family members. And um, the other neat feature about it is once you set up that Android family thing, you can then have parental controls. I personally didn't know about this until Christmas time when I was trying to figure out how to share this Minecraft game. But I'm sure there's others out there. If you like this, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe. If you haven't yet, this channel is about DIY ways to save money, I talk about real estate, other financial topics as well. So subscribe if you haven't yet, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.